Do you think we should talk about that? Should we reveal that? Like all the sponsors on that stage and whatnot, how we did I this? I think it's an interesting concept because no one else has really done it before and that kind of paid for the They the totally production. paid for the yeah, whole tour. That, about it. Uh, That's what I'm true, saying. Yeah. Go ahead, yeah. Let's do it. Wow, this is an interesting story. Can <laughs> so, you tell this one? Yeah, yeah, I mean, like this was another video when, when we, we didn't really want to do a typical video, didn't want to be in the video, so we were like, let's just make this when it's actually, you know, showing the fans. We were already an arena headlining band, and even though it was... We were like the biggest unknown band that's in the world right. at this point. I mean, it was And it was perfect time houses. to expose our, our fans, because nobody had ever seen these arenas, and the reason that we were, were making such a storm was because right. of these people out in front of us. I mean, look at that. And that's still to the day that rings true. We have the most lethal fans on earth now. Was, to be honest with you, American Capitalist was probably the most fun I had had up until F8 making a record. Mm -hmm. I mean, it just it was a good time. All these songs were just, there was no stress involved, there was nothing. This was just, let's get up there and have as much fun as humanly possible. I think it shows, I mean, obviously. When I, when I was sitting there writing this, I actually called Zoe and I was like, dude, I wrote this song and the lyrics involved Tupac, Dimebag, beer, NASCAR. And he was like, oh, I'm what like, the oh, fuck? Shit. <laughs> and you came in and you, were, and you told me immediately, like, this is one of my favorite songs ever. Yeah. I, because I didn't expect what it's going to be. So when you told me, it's like, I'm like, holy shit. So this has a funny story because we were sitting in a tour bus and most of the people on the bus may or may not have ingested a pan of freaking magic mushrooms. <laughs> And everybody <laughs> went that into the gas station. I don't know if it happened, right? I'm just saying. So everybody went into the gas station and they came back in these NASCAR jackets. And I'm looking at this colorful jacket. Everybody bought one because obviously they thought it was colorful and colors look good at the moment, right? <laughs> so everybody has these NASCAR jackets and I'm looking at the jackets. And I'm like, hey, like there's something about this. You know, every one of these patches, like a million dollars. Can we do that? put all this stuff on stage. A band never has done this, right? Yeah. We can be on the stage, we can, because, you know, in, in, in NASCAR it's completely normal. And so that's what we did. We, 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 this is what we did. We basically marketed the shit out of ourselves by taking all of our sponsors and our endorsers right. and we threw them up behind us. And yeah. That also ended up being the cover for American Capitalism. And it was actually a lot of fun to do it. A lot of people don't understand that these sponsors are really what pay for these giant fucking rock concerts. Oh yeah, yeah. And and everybody yeah. was like, "How do you guys afford these stages? We had <laughs> like, like well, nine trucks, yeah. not, you know, <laughs> nobody." Because look, it looked like Times Square, and if you look at Times Square, yeah. what is it? Just a bunch of neon signs with advertising. Nobody actually thought that. No, no, no. Those are paid for. Yeah, mm -hmm. true American yeah. capitalism, right there. And absolutely. <laughs> but look how it worked for you. We could sell the concert tickets for $30 yep. instead of 80 yep. and you still get to see this big show because the production we was We don't have to make for. a video, I'm just saying. <laughs> I ended up working out great, man. I miss those LEDs. We should actually uh, work on getting some shit like that back for this next tour, my friend. This is my time to shine. I've got the stars to prove it. Man, there's uh, the expression. There it is. Dying bite, like a dying. That was fun. This is a good time, man. I love making videos like this. Look at those fans.